Bishop Francis Walioke of the Sword of the Spirit Ministries International Ibadan has described the senior pastor of Dynamis International Gospel Center, Dr. Paul Enenche, as one of the leading voices of God out of Nigeria to the nations of the world. Bishop Walioke, who spoke at the second day evening session of the Dunamis Kingdom Glory and Power World Conference 2021, said, Dunamis at 25 feels like Dunamis at 70. He said it is the achievement of several decades, multiples of 25 years packed into one. He congratulated Dr. Paul and Becky Enenche for their tremendous achievements with Dunamis Church for the past 25 years. Somebody shout hallelujah. If you're excited to be in the presence of the Lord today, shout a loud hallelujah. You may be seated just for one minute. Uh, I give glory to God for this great honor and this great opportunity to be at this great celebration today. And I want to and I want to acknowledge the great grace of God, the marvelous grace of God, the amazing grace of God that rests upon God's servant, God's apostle, God's prophet, Dr. Paul. And then to please celebrate God. Five years it looks like 70 years. It's uh, the, the achievement of several decades, multiples of 25 years packed into one. That is what the grace of God can do. We recognize grace. Without any doubt, Dr. Paul had become one of the leading voices of God out of Nigeria to the nations of the world. In this house tonight, 37 nations are seated and uh, several, several other nations are watching online. And yet, the best is to come. The best is yet to come. The Bible says of the righteous that the path of the just is like the shining light that shining more and more unto the perfect day. So Dr. Paul, you will shine brighter day by day. Amen. You will work stronger day by day. Amen. The Lord will enlarge you on every side day by day. Uh, when I was uh, praying this morning, this scripture came to me, Second Thessalonians, chapter 1 and verse 11 and I'm going to read it and let me read it from the New Living Translation 2nd Thessalonians chapter 1 verse 11 so we keep on praying for you and Dr. Paul Mommy and I, we do asking our God to enable you to live a life worthy of his call you already do that but the latter part of the scripture struck me this morning May he give you the power to accomplish all the good things your faith prompts you to do. But there are six great things in your heart that your faith is prompting you to do. You will see them in manifestation. On behalf of the Pentecostal Fellowship of Nigeria, the founding fathers, the National Advisory Council, the National Executive Council, and the over 65 million Pentecostals in Nigeria today, we wish you a happy celebration. You are going from glory to glory. Please give Jesus a big, big, big hand. Give him a hand. Thank you. Thank you. Can we all stand up on our feet as we give the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords?